at 23 against Flamengo. Now into the corner for three for Ogilvy. That one just missed. Offensive rebound tipped by Jordan Williams. Didn't go the first time, but got it back up. Williams chased out near midcourt, gets it over to Calibaris now to Ogilvy. He drives baseline. I think he hit the rim on the way up with the first shot, but then up ahead to Diaz. He feeds it down low. And that three-pointer is up and good. Hinkle with the left hand. High degree of difficulty on that one, Andrew. Outside to Santos for three. That's good. Diaz wants the ball. Instead, another three. That's good. Marcio Santos. Oh, that's David Jackson. The lead is eight. Hassel. It's Ogilvy. He pulled the brakes on, puts it up and in. I don't I don't think he has. Jackson. Bronco working it around the outside. Three on the way. That's good. Starting to pull away here early. Diaz on the handoff. I'm sure there were some of the stats that we talked about at the beginning. Perotti hounded. Ogilvy, baseline left side, that's good. Jackson working his way toward the paint. Oh, beautiful feed from Diaz. <laughs> Ogilvy at the other end. Now Perotti, Hassel off the glass and in. That last shot, they really closed out on the high pick and roll, recovered off of it. Great defense by Franklin Hassel, and then a steal in the backcourt. Yes, from the corner for three, it's missed. Offensive rebound and the easy putback. 37-year-old Heisler Guillant, member of the Venezuelan national team. Franklin Hassel goes up and stuffs it with the left hand. Well, you can't be zero for zero and be 100%. Not how that works. I haven't missed, have I? <laughs> I rest my taken one, though. That's right. Can't miss me. Oh, my shoot. goodness. Wesley Ferreira. Hassel. Outside to Brian Garcia. Brian. Garcia, Garcia on the attack with the right hand and lays it in. Garcia for three, and that is good. Garcia. Yeah, if you're gonna wrap your arm around somebody, you, you can you can do that, but you gotta make it quick and then and then move your arm. You can't just do it for maybe a three count, and then you better be kind of shifting your position and moving your hand. Tough shot by Federico Haller gets the other end. You get the lead back to eight. Santos the rebound and Franco running again. Outside to Santos. He spins past Haller. Oh, what a pretty move. Scala to David Jackson. Oh my goodness, what a pass. 6.21 to play in this second quarter. Alongside Andrew Hunt, I'm Craig. Manfio, Manfio. Yeah, Kyle Manfio had 28 points and 4-4 four of four from two-point range. Or no, he was 3-3 three of three and he hit a couple free throws as well. Mm -hmm. We mentioned that earlier. I, I don't know that I've ever seen somebody go perfect from three for more than like maybe five shots, like five for five. After the offensive rebound, 
Boy, and that was just too easy for Charles Hinkle, six foot six, backing down six three. Golan Good. Yeah, it looks like he he kind of tried to pull the chair there at the last minute, but Hinkle was able to gather himself and get up a nice nice shot at the rim. Perotti, the long three pointer missed. Hassel, the offensive rebound, got the bucket, and he's going to go to the line to try to complete the three point play. Every game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Now Perotti gets his defender with the air and then missed. Perotti wanted a foul call, nothing doing. Well, Santos at the other end. A lot of contact, no whistle, but he makes the bucket. My goodness. So biggest lead of the game now, 16 points for Franca. Hassel works his way in and lays it in with the left hand. An awkward looking left hand hook it. shot. Jackson for three. That's good. Hassel kicks it back out to Ducasse. One minute to play. Ducasse from the right elbow. Yes. Dos Santos into the corner for Jackson. Back to Dos Santos. Franco works it around. Open three. Splash. Beautiful. Clock at six, now five. Guillaume for three. Yes! Eisler Guillaume! Again! One, one point at a time is, is the way you got to do it. You, there's no 20 point play. <laughs> Franca passes the ball in a possession versus the same for Abreka Maccabi. And also the, the amount of dribbling that happens in that last possession by Maccabi. There was about six or seven dribbles, and the same guy dribbling shot the ball between them and their teammates versus Franca, who I feel moves the ball pretty well. Kind of like uh, movie Hoosiers. I want three passes oh, before every shot. Oh. Made you pass it a number of times before you shot the ball. So you ended up just making these passes that, well, yeah, that's kind of a tough break for Ogilvy too. I feel like he was already just standing there. Diaz for three. Yes, Lucas Diaz. Leads 25. Franca 10 of 26 from the yard. But a nice job by Garcia getting back as Jackson leaked out. Jackson forces up the shot off the glass and in. Tough shot by David Jackson. Jackson now with 12. Gordon Williams. Hassel. Williams spins off the glass. Yes. I mean, I really, I'd say probably good shot to master no matter what level you want to play at. Pass on the paint, the jump left hand. Hook is up and good. Oh, zip pass intercepted by Perotti. With five minutes to play in this third quarter, Hebraica Maccabi making a little run here. Beautiful drive by Lucriano Perot to the layup. Had a little bit too much inertia going, and not by enough, but you got to win the quarter at least. Now Diaz for three, and that is good. Alimaris the rebound. Shot clock is off. Game clock at 16. Williams. Spinning, leaning, 13-footer. Tough shot by Jordan Williams. Oh, oh my goodness. Scala gets it to Diaz. Baseline right side. High arcing jumper is good. Or maybe he got some late baskets. Late baskets of the first quarter. Yeah, I think he did, but don't forget, he, he didn't take a shot until probably three-quarters of the way through the first quarter. Diaz working on Hatler, giving it up. Now getting it back underneath the rim. Just beautiful ball moving around the outside by Franca. Leads to the easy bucket. And then they get a, yep. a look at an easy layup. They had probably two looks at, at a decent three-point shot that I wouldn't have minded if they took. Yeah. Hatler missed the open three. Hinkle to Diaz, thought about the three, gets it back to Hinkle. Hinkle oh, spins his way between a pair of defenders. 
Lead back to 26. Brody the behind the back pass to Federico Haller. Barbosa got the defender in the air instead takes it himself, elevate and jams it home with two hands. Perotti on the attack, pulls up, kicks it out to Ogilvy. He puts up the long trade. That is good. Scala looking, now giving up left side. This time it's Hinkle on the take. Open three by Perotti. That's straight through. Back outside to Scala. Santos, strong up over Haller. Salcones de Salapa of Mexico. Jackson, the turnaround fadeaway with the shot clock winding down. Hassel, the rebound. Calimaris tries to take it all the way himself and does. Goes up over Paulo Barbosa and lays it in. He didn't do that against Diaz. Away by oh, Over the head pass and the shot blocked by a flat-footed Wesley Ferreira. A wasted opportunity there by Abraika Maccabi. Not sure it's going to make a ton of difference in the long run. And he's got 11. Perotti now gets it to Hassel in close. Off the glass. Count it! as we'll get a look at it here. I don't think so. And Hassel's an 82% free throw shooter coming into this one. He's got a good looking free throw form, but man, when, when he shoots the ball in gameplay from anything farther than about five feet out, it looks pretty awkward. Lead back to 24, 88, 64. Ducasse working on Jackson. Shot won't go. Hassel had the rebound. Saves it in over his head, but he saves it up ahead to Franca. Barbosa didn't have any help, so he did it himself. Garcia into the corner for Haller. Fades away from eight feet, and that's good. Haller now with eight points pending the free throw. Surprised we didn't see more of Eduardo Elevi in this game. Wow, pretty finish. And let the clock wind out. Hey, 